William Engdahl is joining us today. He's a political economist who's written quite a number of books, uh, which I must urge you to, to read for yourself. A Century of War, which deals with the uh, Anglo-American oil politics of the 20th century and been updated actually to the 21st. Uh, Gods of Money, uh, Seeds of Destruction, Full Spectrum Dominance, The Lost Hegemon, and Target China are amongst his uh, amazing reads. So he's going to be discussing quite a few of the current events that we're looking at from our position now in 2015. And he's also a Princeton graduate like myself, so I have to give him a shout out on that. On that. Thank you, William, for joining us. Good to be with you, Sean. Uh, As one example, in Libya, it was much more difficult because Gaddafi had given his people the highest living standard in all of Africa, in fact, uh, for much of the world. And uh, there was no mass-based popular dissatisfaction as there was in Egypt or some other countries. So they simply went in with what Hillary Clinton called the responsibility to protect, a term that uh, the networks of George Soros Open Society Foundation came up with, and bombed Libya back to the Stone Age and created total chaos there to knock out Libya, just as Gaddafi, uh, Ben Ali, and Mubarak were in the process of creating an Islamic bank, the kernel of an Islamic bank that would be independent of the dollar. Mm, that's an important was, point then. So you're saying that, so that was part of the motivation for Egypt was Mubarak was working with Gaddafi at that point in a, in a sort of a separate I, 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 development I, bank. Yeah. And uh, I think the, the longer term game is to create such disorder and chaos that uh, Europe is caught off balance, uh, China and Russia are caught off balance and that's very directly with Syria. And Iran does not have the possibility to bring its huge reserves of natural gas from the North Pars field in, in the Persian Gulf through Iran, through Iraq by pipeline, through Syria by pipeline, an agreement that they signed just before the uh, Syria uh, destabilization by the CIA kicked off in, in 2012. Uh, 